Back again viewers, Andy's vlogs and food reviews here today and um, we're in London, in South Ruisley, sta near South Ruisley Station. Now, I do apologise, the uh, last couple of days I haven't done any vlogs, uh, obviously because I'm, I'm on holiday like I mentioned in the previous vlog I did, on, um, on a trip down memory lane. Um, I did obviously have to get all my uh, packing done and everything sorted before you come away so time just ran away with me a bit so didn't get a chance to vlog but while I'm in London like I said in before I will do a few vlogs as I always do but I hope everybody's keeping well and enjoying their day right then currently situated in northwest London and I'll just go along where what we've got here right now First of all, I want to say there's plenty of places for, for a takeaway Tuesday. When I got to the hotel, I couldn't believe how many places there is. So it's literally take me pick of what I want. Uh, you got a chicken land there, and I went there yesterday with my other half, and the food's really nice. Um, they were a, a, like a bu boundless bucket for 15 49 and I don't think that's bad for London, because some, some, of, some of the prices. So I was expecting... Uh, Rocky prices to be honest. I really was when I got here. And you're going to off last circle day eight news and then you got look here south through slip station look. How I pronounce that right. And some work over there. You saw the uh, tube map in the underground is up further up the road. Yeah. Ah, oh, the Monopoly. Yeah, we've got a few of them. Me and my other half, we're collecting them. I think we need one for every one for every um, street at the moment for the pri for a prize. Our view is the Severa Hotel. Then you've got a pub here called the Middlesex Arms. And then apparently along here there's um, chip shop here which I was trying to resist from doing a chip shop next week I was going to do something different but I've been told that the food is exceptionally good in there that Paul's fish and chip restaurant over there so it might be worth a bit of a challenge for me to go and have a look then we've got Sainsbury's nearby and there's an Argos and a Lloyd's Pharmacy situated inside there as well then we got Bucky's out, uh, Bucky's out there, Carl. Like I say, so many places to try for food along here. And we got Mighty Grill there. And then the news and booze next door. I think that's an airless as yet, is yet. Well, I think my, my dad would be ideally situated, cost of coffee. There's the proof where we are. I come down here on the train. I, I didn't want to drive down here with all the different uh, air zones and the traffic clocks like I coming from London Euston to our hotel was absolutely horrendous. I'm so glad I didn't drive. never been to this part of London before. I've been to Wembley before on two occasions, but I've never been to this part. And 
we got a uh, florist there, yeah, flower shop. Look at that. I think they want to test me on food here, I think. There's that many different uh, restaurants. Yeah, it was the tube and train station, that was up there. Yeah. Yeah, I was told where... I was told, um, I was told, uh, better than the tube station up here where you get to, so I'm going to Wembley to watch the England match. Apparently we've got to get this, um, the tube somewhere along here. So we'll, uh, we'll have a little glance on the old internet and see what... See where, where it is. The taxi driver did tell me it was only five minutes away. Yeah, I think I'll have a have a look and see where we have to go for Monday, rather than leaving it till the last minute. Yeah, I remember seeing that BP when I looked, uh, when, I, when I did consider driving down there, and I uh, noticed there was a BP on the uh, map. What toll charge it? Oh, oh 30 pence an hour. <laughs> I think it's nearer back home than it is here, that's, that surprised me. I was an Aldi up here. And Alfred's down there. And there's plenty of places to withdraw cash as well, viewers, if you do come here. There's a, pe there's a pe station with a free cash point machine there. And there's um, there's one further down as well. So, And there are now charges. There is one um, next door to the... There's a kebab and burger place down there. And uh, they charge 99 pence. But most of these here are free. So... So say if you do want to withdraw cash, there's a couple of places if you do need it, if you do come here. Right then viewers, I'm going to end this vlog right now. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you'll have a fantastic day. Thanks to everybody who subscribed to the channel of late. I really do appreciate it. And thanks to all the lovely comments. I'll see you on the next one. And it's bye for now.